Hi everyone, Dr. Jess, very highly anticipated video here. This is my boyfriend Jason. Hey guys. Uh, so, you guys have been waiting for this video for a while. I want to preface this video by saying this is about someone's personal health journey. It is my boyfriend. What I saw and witnessed, um, I would not have believed as a doctor had I not seen it and seen him all the time. I don't know if you would have believed it. No, there's no way. And so we really, I had to kind of rope him into sharing it with you guys because it is personal and it's a very vulnerable story, but we wanted you guys to know that if anyone's suffering from these health problems that don't give up keep searching and listen to your body. And so without further ado, uh, Jason, I'm gonna let you tell your story since it's about you and it's very personal. So share how you will. Sure. Well, thank you. Hi guys. Uh, not sure really where to start. So uh, long story short as possible. <laughs> Gotta fit a lot in here. Um, so this has been something I've dealt with uh, looking back probably most of my life. Uh, not having quite as much energy as I felt I should, a little bit of brain fog, not quite getting traction, a lot of rumination in my mind, not getting great sleep at night, and then anxiety for as long as I can remember. So as many of us do, I found ways to self-medicate, and even though I knew to eat healthy and ate extremely well, I uh, really still didn't know that I was sick, but I was dealing with my anxiety by having a couple organic beers after work and, and coping Coping with it, you know, with I mean, <laughs> food and alcohol, really. Yeah, I mean, well, let's see, you know, who doesn't love good food yeah. and, and, a, and a good alcoholic drink every now and then after work. I think a lot of people can say, hey, if it's organic and you source it, then enjoy. I, don't, I think America is still in a place where we accept that as being okay for the most part. And some even consider it healthy. You know. Yeah. It's sad to say. So we will enlighten you. <laughs> <laughs> So uh, honestly, this process really started with me having too much to drink one night. And I had known about uh, Jess's products. Dr. Jess has got some amazing products and had introduced me to them without pushing too hard. And uh, once I knew I had had too much to drink and really needed to dive into this health process, I started her uh, MicrobioMaster, started that cleanse, and instantly felt horrible. <laughs> Herb sign erections like you wouldn't believe, you know, cake frosting off of my tongue, eyelids stuck together, itchiness all over, ears, eyes, nose, throat. Uh, I mean, overnight, overnight, like brushing white stuff off his tongue into the sink. Right. It was unbelievable. So. And not to mention, I'm frustrated like crazy. Uh, oh, really geez. an emotional roller coaster for me. <laughs> and this process really showed me how interlaced our emotions, our feelings, and our thought process is with the bacteria and bugs that are in our bodies. Well said. So in addition to the symptoms I described earlier, I also had some swelling and pain in my re reproductive areas. Honestly, to the point I'd seen experts thinking I might even have cancer. Like testicular cancer, guys. If you feel knots down there in your testicles, what do you think? Hey, there's something wrong, right? <laughs> So, uh, s sadly, I got no help going to Western Medicine. They honestly just told me to get different underwear. And uh, as soon as I started the cleanse, the MicrobioMaster cleanse, I started seeing a reduction in the swelling and the pain. And within a couple months, it, it is a long process, guys. Within a couple months of doing the MicrobioMaster, I saw weight and swelling and inflammation melt off of me like you wouldn't believe. I mean, he had a little bit of a pooch before and I was like, this guy eats better than me. Why? It must be the alcohol. Well, that was partly it, but he was also feeding a certain negative um, yeast and mold community there that is unwanted. Candida. Yeah, yeast, candida, yeah. 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 And, and so it, instantly, once this guy's cleansed, he has a six pack. Now, my product didn't do it all itself, so let's let us be real here. Right. Um, we're still going through the detox process because he has mold. Right. Yeah. Fortunately, a... we found out about the uh, fact that a lot of these issues can occur in pairs, frenemies, as Dr. Jess likes to call them, co-infections, as they're also known. So based on my personal history, looking back, it was easy for us to discern, still waiting on the test results to prove this, but to discern just from some general questions and looking back through my history that I was exposed to mold many times throughout my life. And even as a little kid. Yeah. And yeah. then the emotional scarring and wounds that go with it also create room in your body for dis-ease to continue. 
Well, you guys know there's always an emotional trauma or stressor, or almost always, before people's, bam, immune systems take a hit. So that's kind of his story mirrored that, what, I, what we see a lot with that, it mirrored it. So uh, the process, you guys have, many have asked, how do you get rid of this stuff? And truth be told, it's still a process. But I feel so much better. I feel like I'm getting my life back, my body back, my brain back. It is unreal. I'm just so incredibly grateful for this process. I mean, he's reverse aged. His skin's gotten better. Some of you have seen the hair photos. Yeah, and it still continues to grow in. That's what we want you guys to know, especially men. If you're losing your hair or you're having issues down south, please don't just write it off and take a pill the rest of your life. There's a reason that your body isn't working right. Please work with me or let's get to the functional root cause. So, yeah. so my process was the microbiome master. That's what I started with. That is really what I noticed uh, a tremendous difference with. <laughs> <laughs> so what we have also used to go along with that are two amazing products that supplemented the cleanse for me. Um, Microbiome Master, then Liver Master, uh, those are the two of Dr. Jess's products I used in pairs. That reminds me of something really quick, side note really quick. I want you guys to know in Eastern medicine, in traditional Chinese medicine, the um, liver meridian is attached to the sinus cavities and the reproductive organs, both of which were swollen and having issues throughout this detox. Right. And so I knew that his liver was pretty diseased because of that pattern. So that's why I really pushed some liver supporting herbs too. Absolutely. Yeah, sorry, yeah. go ahead. No problem. And so once we did get through uh, or recognize that the microbiome, the liver, all of these things needed to be dealt, dealt with, I also found through some encouragement, <laughs> this amazing product. What we had was liquid biocidin to go along with that. And almost instantly, within maybe 10 minutes of taking this product, I noticed a reaction in my lymph nodes and some swelling in my scalp, some itchiness, crazy boils came up in my skin within a half hour. It was coming out of his scalp. like, And what that <clears throat> means is when you use this, it has essential oils in it that act as a biofilm buster. And so that's how powerful essential oils can be. And immediately after a few pumps, he was with me, so I told him to take 10. <laughs> um, I knew he was gonna have Herxheimer healing detox reactions. Crazy. But what happened is all his cervical lymph nodes popped up like marbles and he got kind of cysts, almost like cystic acne on his head, where they were running out of his sinuses. And I was so happy because because this meant his limp, his immune system had seen the bugs and was sending soldier cells to replicate here and then running the yeast and mold out of his sinuses. It was amazing to watch. And very, very important part of this process is taking binders. Mm -hmm. Something to bind up these bugs once a great product, whether it's Biocidin, Microbiome Master, uh, essential oils, whatever combination of products you're using to propagate these bugs from getting out of your, out of where they're hiding, out of the biofilms and where your body can recognize them. Is uh, GI Detox is the product that comes along with Biocidin by the same company. Take this about two hours after I would take a crazy amount of this, <laughs> encouraged by the doctor. <laughs> and it, it made a tremendous difference. Also for, for myself is uh, chlorophyll. This made a tremendous difference, or excuse me, chlorella made a tremendous difference for me. Chlorophyll works too. Um, also works as a binder. I was chewing on my candy. Yeah. And then another thing is I want you guys to know is mold. It not only gets in the sinus cavities, but it gets in the frontal sinuses, the maxillary sinus, um, and it really stays there and it's pretty indolent infection. So you really want to look into get some silver, colloidal silver, some silver nasal sprays with EDTA. Um, silver psyllid made by Designs for Health is great. And I want you guys to know I've learned so much through this mold process that you are going to be seeing some second tier products for me that really help some of these indolent chronic kidney infections. I've learned a lot from you. Thank you. Thank yeah. you. It's been a horrible process <laughs> that I'm very grateful for. And uh, it wasn't just these products, guys. It, we were very attentive to the diet. I was doing coffee enemas. I was going and getting vitamin IVs. I got ozone treatments. I really looked at any way in which I could take my health into my own hands because this is not something uh, many people even know about, know how to address, or even are aware of. Um, I wasn't even aware that I had these issues going on until we started this process. Mm -hmm. Very important about vitamin IVs, coffee enemas, you got one dose of ozone. This kind of stuff really can um, put the immune system overdrive and really push you over the edge in your healing process. 
Again, I wanna really repeat, as long as you've been sick, sometimes it takes that long to heal. You're not gonna heal this in a month, guys. It's month four and he pretty much lives with the doctor. So, and just saying it's a really, as long as you've been sick, your body takes time to heal. And when it does see the infection, it's gonna create inflammation and problems for you, headaches, pushing things out, problems with the bowels. And that's because your body's freaking out when it finally sees it. it, it it's a good thing it's happening, but it, it can be a miserable process. I've watched him. Um, so, <laughs> seriously. I tried not to take it out on her. <laughs> Fortunately, we have an amazing dog that many of you are familiar with, <laughs> so she could take the dog for a walk, I could take the dog for a I'm walk. I'm like, deuces. I'm yeah. like, <laughs> I'm just kidding. So, so, you guys, know that you can heal. Basically, everything works down here now. Everything's growing here now. He feels so much better, and he's taking some, some of the other supplements of mine for immunity, for stress. And you can treat those, but you have to get the root cause of the infection. That's right, guys. So stay healthy. We really appreciate you guys watching the video. Um, please know that if you do have questions or you ha are concerned that you have some infection like this, please seek out a trusted healthcare provider that can be your guide along the way. Please don't use this as medical advice because everyone is different and you really need to seek the, health, um, the advice of a healthcare professional for the correct testing as well too. And know that I'm available if you'd like, but you can always find someone who specializes in your area. Just do the due diligence. So thanks for watching, guys. Thank you. We love you. Bye. Bye.